Hi, I'm Carolyn and I'm going to show you today how to make a delicious gourmet meal right in your own dorm room. All you need is a microwave. So the recipe that we'll be doing today is shrimp scampi. Very fancy. The first ingredient that I got is this. Um, a bunch of shrimp, as you can see, it only cost $2.76. If you get the pink shrimp, it means they're already cooked. The second ingredient you need is a beautiful yellow lemon. And really all you need is like a tablespoon of the juice. Third ingredient, garlic. I like to use this kind of garlic. Well, this is called chopped garlic. Um, it's pre-minced. You can keep it in your mini fridge. Um, it stays good for a really long time. It's cheap and easy. But if you don't have a mini fridge, there's an alternative kind of garlic that you can use. Dry minced garlic. Um, on a little side note, the town of Santa Clara is really close to another town called Gilroy which is renowned for its garlic festival, a weekend-long event where they have garlic cook-offs. They even crown a garlic queen. Um, it's been going on for about 30 years, and it's great, really nearby, and maybe that's why I like garlic so much. Um, oh, and the last ingredient you need is parsley. And once again, you can use fresh, but I like the dry version. You can just have it hanging around in your dorm room. It stays good forever. And... <laughs> Olive oil. <laughs> Don't be intimidated. This is the Costco kind. It's like a gallon of olive oil or something like that. Um, but once again, all you need is a little dash of this. And if you don't have it on hand, feel free to use butter. My first step is going to be to chop off the tails. There, it wasn't that easy. Just make them all. All right, so we got our lovely little bowl of delicious pink shrimp. Yum. Next step, I'm going to add a little bit of garlic. And um, you can just take like a little, I don't know, just like a little, I don't know, teaspoon or so. Uh, wipe that in there. There you go, mix that around. Oh. Okay, so now I'm going to add some olive oil. The beauty of this recipe is that it's really, really hard to mess up. You can kind of just guess about the ingredients, add more as you're eating it if you want to. It's really just, I'm just going to eyeball this. Uh, a little more. Okay, a tablespoon of olive oil. Okay, so we've added one tablespoon of olive oil, um, a teaspoon or so of garlic, and oh, can't forget the lemon. Here it is. Okay. Just slice a little bit of this. Okay, so now I'll just pop this in the microwave for like 45 seconds. Since all we're doing is heating it up, we're not actually cooking it. Okay, let's see if it's hot enough. Alright, now enjoy. Mmm. <laughs>